measurement of a standard electrode potential using calamal electrode. What is calamal electrode? Calamal electrode is a reference electrode based on the relationship between elemental mercury and mercurous chloride. What is electrode potential? Electrode potential is an electromotive force of a cell built of a two electrodes. Next we can move on to the how to measure the standard electrode potential using calamal electrode. Electrode whose potential has to be determined is coupled with a standard calamal electrode. Let us consider zinc as an unknown electrode. In this picture we can see zinc is dipped in a zinc sulfate solution and connected to the voltmeter and the calamal electrode is also connected to the voltmeter. In this cell which also be represented as zinc slash zinc 2 plus here we can see this double slash is represented as a salt bridge then Hg Hg2Cl2 slash Cl minus. This is nothing but representation of calamal electrode. Proper measurement of electrode potential of a zinc electrode can be made only when zinc is connected to negative terminal of a voltmeter and standard calamal electrode is connected to the positive terminal of voltmeter. Actually this is a trial error method. There is no given rule that zinc should be connected to negative terminal and calomel electrode should be connected to positive terminal of voltmeter. So initially when calomel electrode was connected to the negative terminal and zinc was connected to the positive terminal of voltmeter, the voltmeter didn't show any reading. So the connection were interchanged. That is, zinc were connected to the negative terminal and calamal electrode were connected to the positive terminal of voltmeter. When this was done, the voltmeter shows some fluctuation. That means nothing but shows reading and that reading is nothing but cell potential and was recorded. If zinc electrode connected to the negative terminal of voltmeter, it act as an anode and calamal electrode connected to the positive terminal of voltmeter, it act as a cathode. So, we know that E cell equal to E cathode minus E anode. That means cell potential of a electrode equal to cell potential of a cathode minus cell potential of anode. Here we already mentioned that zinc electrode act as a anode and calamal electrode act as a cathode. Here cathode is standard calamal electrode that is SCE and anode is zinc electrode so written as E cell equal to ESCE minus EZN. From above equation that is E cell equal to ESCE minus EZN we can change that. Ezn equal to Ese minus E cell. Here the potential of a calamal electrode is known that is constant where E cell is already measured. For substituting these two value corresponding place in that equation we can determine the cell potential of a zinc electrode. This same procedure we can determine the cell potential of all unknown electrode coupling it with standard calamal electrode. This is regarding to the measurement of a standard electrode potential using calamal electrode. Thank you. Wow, that's impressive. You have completed a magic today. For more videos, subscribe. Join our Facebook group and Instagram page for group discussion and live magazine videos for exam preparation in an hour. We start at class like community for students to learn from a friend in a simple way and support them in their own languages. If you are willing to be that one friend who saves us at the exam night preparation, then please join us by visiting classfly.n.